Hello, everybody. Welcome to the first ever episode of the Innovation Labcast. I'm Dave Goodrich. I'm your host. And today I'm so excited to be with you because it is April 18th, 2016, the day before I travel out to the OLC Innovate Conference in New Orleans. And I am just ecstatic about being there. So I'm trying this new thing this week, this brand new thing, just in the spirit of the innovation labs where, you know, you sense a need, you try something out, you see how it goes, you iterate and you learn. And that's kind of what the innovation labs are all about. So truly like um, innovation for, for teaching and learning is what we believe to be born through our collaborations and interconnectedness as educators. So the Innovation Lab is this dedicated space at the conference for you to explore the pervasive challenges we face in the classroom and to craft innovative approaches for better reaching our unique populations of learners. So is it a collaborative professional development space? Is it a technology playground? Is it a design thinking system? With your participation, ladies and gentlemen, it is all of the above. The Innovation Lab space is comprised of two distinct areas. A front area featuring a series of lab stations for you to reflect and experiment at your own pace. And a live demo space for you to take part in scheduled guided experiments led by presenters who we're calling scientists. The lab stations will guide you through an innovation cycle, with each station featuring a different step in the process for creating a strategy or an effective practice or a pedagogical approach. So you'll have the opportunity to interact with emerging technology, connect challenges to innovative practices through hands-on experimentation, and document your ideas in a virtual lab manual, either on your own or collaboratively. And there's going to be lab assistants around, hanging around, and they're going to be on hand to work with you to design, reflect, and create. The live lab space is adjacent to these lab stations and features dedicated space for you to complete a guided lab led by a presenter and these are not your typical sit and get sessions rather you will get your hands dirty right from the start digging into a concrete challenge working collaboratively to design a meaningful solution and leave with an applicable deliverable these two spaces really are designed and meant to work together and ideally you will start in one area and continue to hone and refine the ideas that arise from your experiments in the other area We invite you to make the Innovation Lab your hub and your home base at OLC Innovate and use it as a space to both recharge and ideate anytime you'd like. Our goal really is to simply break us out of our cultural norms for collaboration and professional development and in the process highlight our colleagues doing excellent work. We want to truly invite you to connect with us. If you want to learn more about the Innovation Lab and how you can get involved, um, we really encourage you to ask your questions on social media using the hashtag OLC Innovation Lab. So that's hashtag OLC Innovation Lab. So I don't know about you, but for me, when I go to a conference, I love conferences. Let's start there. I absolutely love learning and experiencing new ideas and writing down as many things as I can to, to help me in my own instructional practice and my own learning experience, design practice and research. But The most valuable thing to me at a conference by far, again and again, continues to be those connections that I make with people I haven't met before um, between sessions and the conversations that emerge maybe over uh, an adult beverage or two or three. But it's just such a great time to get away from the daily grit and grind of our work and to just kick my feet up and reflect on my practices in the past year and to ideate on exciting new approaches to the work that I love in the year ahead on new ideas that I hadn't thought of before from amazing colleagues around the world, truly. That is why, honestly, I'm so excited about these Innovation Lab sessions because really the idea of it is to kind of 
blend together the formal and the formal learning environments that we experience in a conference like this and the informal learning experiences that happen kind of organically and naturally during the duration of a conference. And these innovation lab sessions are really literally just a designed space and some scheduled activities around these ideas. So when we say that we want you to make this space your home, just a place to connect, a, a place to recharge and reflect, we're not kidding. Like literally, this has been a space designed literally for that. If you're like me, you've got too many devices that you've got to charge between sessions and you're running around trying to find places to charge. Hopefully you'll find some places to charge your devices, but also charge your mind and charge your your whole experience at the OLC conference here in the Innovation Lab spaces. Um, one thing I, I hope to be doing, hope to be practicing on a daily basis through this week is this idea of podcasting, um, something that I'm learning a lot more about and I'm excited to explore. So I'm trying it this week. I'm trying it every day. I'm going to be podcasting, um, asking questions of people that I'm learning from at the conference and encouraging you to do the same, encouraging you to whip out your phone and ask your own questions to people that you're learning from so that we can uh, kind of aggregate this this rich body of knowledge that is sometimes uh, thrown to the wind in a conference and oftentimes the connections that don't get made organically hopefully um, this will this space here this innovation lab will be a catalyst for for new connections for you to make and to carry on these conversations around innovation in higher education going forward i do want to bring your attention to some of the exciting lab sessions that are taking place this year in the Innovation Lab, starting with none other than the Ohio State University, Wednesday morning, 9.15, where they're going to be bridging the classroom workspace gap, and they're going to be talking about leveraging student ingenuity to create authentic learning experiences. This is with Joni Tornwall, Julia Donegan, and Philip Newman, again from the Ohio State University. Exciting stuff. After them, at 11.15 on Wednesday, we've got Steve Julin from the Spex Howard School of Media and Arts, and he's going to be talking to us about shooting and producing great video with the iPhone for online learning. At 1.30 on Wednesday... Alicia McRae from John Hopkins University and Kelly Zomas from John Hopkins University are going to be talking to us about the power of do-it-yourself video creation for online courses. At 2.30, Madara Mason from the University of Alaska Fairbanks and e-learning, Heidi Olson from the University of Alaska Fairbanks and e-learning and distance education are going to be talking about creating your own innovation hub. Quite excited to check that out. And then to close things off for Wednesday at 4 o'clock, Kelvin Thompson from the University of Central Florida, as well as Delane Priest from the University of Central Florida, are going to be talking to us about creating a communication model so that students listen and take action. So this is going to be revolving around the quote unquote successful you project. And I'm excited to hear about that, but also with all of these, hear about these things, but also put into practice some of the things that we're learning about in these lab sessions. So these are the things that are happening on Wednesday. If you can make it to one or two of them or all of them for that matter, that's awesome. Uh, but it's going to be good stuff, and I'm excited to learn with you and to take away some pretty amazing things. Again, we're going to try to document a lot of the things and the activity and the excitement that's happening in these spaces as they're going on from day to day. But um, I'm hoping to either tomorrow night, Tuesday night, or Wednesday night um, come back on the air with another podcast episode, hopefully with some friends. Uh, to talk about the things that happened on Wednesday um, in the Innovation Lab space, as well as the whole OLC Innovate conference for that matter. And then to kind of um, forecast some of the exciting Innovation Labs that are going to take place on Thursday and Friday. So that's kind of it for uh, the first initial Innovation Lab cast. So excited about this week. I hope you are too. Can't wait to meet you. Come on by. Say hello. 
to Angela, Ben, and myself, and Jess, and Anne, and all the great, exciting. We've got some amazing people helping out with the Innovation Labs. Um, just want to say thanks to Felice Banner from Clarkson University for all her help. Um, Ryan Bernstein from Northwestern Michigan College. Steve Crawford from Arizona State University. Angela Gunder from the University of Arizona. She's been co-chairing this Innovation Labs with me and is really chairing it. I mean, she's done the bulk of the work and just really appreciate all that her expertise in design and, and her her thinking about it. she's just amazing. You gotta connect with her. Lee Graves Wolf from Michigan State University, huge shout out to her. She's gonna be there for a little bit of the innovation labs and she's also doing a featured presentation, which I'm excited to experience. Just not from Michigan State University. Huge shout out. Come on now. Just not one of the most amazing instructional designers I know. Robbie Melton, who is the Associate Vice Chancellor of Mobilization Emerging Technology from the Tennessee Board of Regents. Anne Musgrove from Florida Atlantic University. Ben Scragg from The Ohio State University. And Frank Tomzik from Rush University. I mean, these are top-notch people, and you got to connect with them. There's going to be more volunteers, too, more people uh, roaming in and out of the Innovation Labs that I'm excited for you to connect with, learn from, learn with, share with. It's going to be amazing. Can't wait to see you there. 